previously on Pretty Little Liars. Dr. Owens. I thought I'd let you know in person. The judge set a date for the hearing. The court can compel your friends to come, but they may not be sympathetic to the cause. So this court thing. It's just about how we feel about Charlotte getting out. It is about A getting out. Five A free years. What are we gonna do? You got involved in government first, and your mother is going to be a state senator. Your bosses are very angry at me. They're not angry. He gave me an advance on a second book. You know what happened in South America? College wasn't what I thought it was gonna be. I had a hard time. When my dad died, I just couldn't see a point to it. My family has always had a missing part. What's missing is my sister, Charlotte, and now I want to bring my sister home. You're here to tell me if you'd feel safe should Charlotte DeLaurentis leave the hospital. No, I would not feel safe. So that's that. Judge says Charlotte can go home. Hi, Ellie. Did Charlotte come to your hotel room last night? I don't know where she is. You don't know where Charlotte is? We went to bed, and this morning she was gone. What is she doing here, making sure that Charlotte's really dead? Charlotte was dead when she was thrown from the bell tower. The death's been ruled a homicide. You'll get a call. Allison? Her burns severely limit her ability to use her hands. She couldn't have done this. You're taking Sarah off the suspect list? I don't understand. Charlotte's death was violent. There was a struggle. You sure you want to hear this? I need to know what happened to my sister. Her neck was broken by blood force trauma before she was thrown from the bell tower. I'm sorry, Allison. We're looking at everyone, but particularly the people Charlotte targeted. Do you think your friends could have had anything to do with Charlotte's death? No, I don't. You sure about that? The flower was placed in her hand to make it look like a suicide. Fingernails were wiped clean. So were her hands. I'm so sorry, Allie. Who would do something like this? Sarah Harvey. Well, the police can't see her. She could push someone off the building when she can barely hold a fork. Maybe she's lying about that. Or maybe she had help. Either way, they took her off the suspect list. Aria left town quickly. She had to go back to work. Well, she was still angry with Charlotte. She wasn't angry. She was scared. And she said everything that she needed to say upon that stand. I saw her dad this morning. He said that she left town one day earlier than planned. I was hoping that you guys would come to dinner tonight. Emily, Caleb, Jordan too. I could really use the company. It's been really lonely in that house. Sure. What should we bring? Hi. Oh, wow. Did you guys bring enough food? Oh, there's more. I'll be fine. How are you doing? I'm holding up, I guess. I'm glad everyone can make it. Except for Aria. Has anyone talked to her? Uh, not since she left. Yeah, I've called her a few times. She hasn't returned my calls. She's probably just busy with work. What are you doing? I was just gonna make some room. I bought those for Charlotte to welcome her home. Spence. Okay, well then the flowers can stay there. I'll go get some serving spins. <laughs> 